Oi boys, welcome, welcome to another video on the channel. We are back with the Dolphins and it is time for the State of Origin plan of the New South Wales Blues. This team is stacked. Let's take a look. First of all, before we run through the 17 man squad, let's uh let's go ahead and address the elephant in the room. There's no Josh Adokar, there's no Matt Burton. Their moment will come, just not on the save. Alright, so let's go through it. Starting off the back five, our skipper James Tedesco. On the wing, Joseph Swali'i. Let's go ahead and chuck him on the right side. Bring Toto to the left. Atra Mitchell at left center. Tom Trebojevic at right center. And Joseph Swali'i will wrap up the back five. That is a stacked side, like I said. The Fox and Burton will get their go, but I won't be in the safe. As for the halves, Nathan Cleary will be accompanied by Cody Walker. No Jerome Luai this time around. I low-key wanted to throw um Moses in the six, but we ultimately went off Cody Walker. The front row, we have Jake Chaboyevic, Api Kodoisau, and Payne Haas. Our bigger mission, no Damian Cook. Back row, we have Angus Crichton and Cameron Murray. And at lock, Isaiah Yo. The bench, as you can see, a couple new faces. We have Ryan Pappenhausen, Hudson Young, Junior Paolo, and Toby Rudolph. I don't even think I picked Cookie in the squad at all, actually. But yeah, that's our 17 heading into this uh, this game one clash. I'll be interested to see what the Queenslanders look like four years into the save. Let's run it. And here we are, playing at ANZ Stadium. Let's see the Queenslanders. Hi, Mohant. Kyle Felt on the wings, that's interesting. We have uh, DCE and Munster in the halves. Front row, standard. Back row, standard as well. Carrigan playing lock. Uh, Collins, Welch, Brimo on the bench and done. All right, this should be pretty interesting. Should be cruisy to be honest. If the squad we got is stacked. Of course, as soon as I say that, we let one through on the kickoff. Last play. Up it goes, we have weapons on the edges. Tom Trebojevic, what a guy. Imagine having him and uh, Joey Suwali'i as we get hammered in the tackle. Going to run the short side here. Bit of an overlap, draw and pass finds Murray. And yeah, we're still just past the 20, might have to kick our way out of trouble here. No offense for old Tommy Turbo. Let's try to sneak one away off the inside ball play. That's a that's a great kick. Look at the distance. Nathan Cleary gets taken into touch. It's going to be a 40-20 regardless. Yes, sir. This will be fun. Play kicking with uh, Cleary trying to control the game and whatnot. As we look for Cody Walker behind Latrell Mitchell. We slide over from deep. Man, Walker Doe from a long way out. So lucky to even uh, make it over the line there, sliding over. Got Payne here, one off the ruck. Slow markers. Nice bump. Oh, I thought we could find. I think it was Isaiah Yo back on the inside shoulder. Out wide, can we take him into touch? High more hunt. Should be a field day for our left edge. No offense. To Hanto, of course, on the toe, taken by Yo, and we stay in the field of play. Let's look for Turbo here. Uppy, wide ball, straight through. Tom Turbo taken by KP. Cleary, we'll get Cleary running off Murray here. That's a decent ball. No, it's only third. I'm gonna find the line. Crady Walker. We have the wind. I don't think it'll make it unless we get a guard bounce. And slowly but surely, it trickles its way past the 20. Cody Walker. This is uh, this is refreshing to say the least. That's one. Move. Playing with absolute weapons from 1 to 17. As we go to Cleary, Cody taken. Let's go back to Cleary here. Running on to it, Tedesco, he's taken. Back to the left, left, right, left, right. Oh, how's that pass? And the quick tap on to Latrell Mitchell. There's your second try of the day. We definitely ran behind our own man there. And I'm surprised we actually got that pass away with Cody Walker. We quickly tapped the cutout option. But 
But anyway, 12 points up, 22 minutes gone. Not a bad half of footy, 60% time possession, 4 from 6 completions, only the 4 missed tackles and 8 line breaks to 3. On the other side, Queensland completing all their sets. And uh, yeah, despite all the possession we've had, only 12 points on the board. As for the bench, let's go ahead and blood some players, shall we? We'll bring Pappenhausen in for Isaiah Yo. Swap out that front row. Bang, bang, and Hudson Young in for Cam Murray. Let's go, this, this will be interesting. If we can keep them scoreless, that'll be a nice little in this game. Toby Rudolph's first run. Gets through one defender. Let's get uh let's get Big Paulo a run. Tried playing flats. Pappenhausen first receiver. We go to Walker. He finds Latrell. Draw a pass, Brian Toto. And the fend on Heimel Hunt. Like I said in the first half. It's going to be a long night for that right edge of the Queenslanders. How good is that? Pappenhausen's first touch of the ball. Plays out the back to Cody Walker. And they get it out to our strike weapon. Our Dolphins boy Latrell Mitchell. Second tackle. Test the edges again. That wasn't touched apparently. But for sure that was a knock on. Yes, we're getting a little too carried away with our plays inside our own 20 we finally get punished on the second just gonna press the line oh that's too easy big david fifita will stroll over for their first points of the day you know i thought that's where they were going uh the only problem is that we didn't hang back I'm trying to put a hit on here but they keep eluding us mitchell all over val holmes I forgot Holmes was on the right edge for Queens and we low-key disrespected them as he slides right through. Uh, to be honest, it's because Harbour Hunt's on the wing. What a battle that would be though. Uh, Val Holmes. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Our goal line defense. Slipping and sliding all over the place. Both second rowers. Alright, our goal line defense is uh, in shambles at the moment. Again, we saw where the ball was going, but didn't make the tackle. This is definitely closer than it should have been. Yeah, we kind of took our foot off the gas. Got a little too cocky. Eight minutes left. Looking a little thin to the left. Teddy. Murray. Latrell. And Toto's taken high. A swinging arm. I was getting ready to... Uh, Get that piston of a fan going. Pump it downfield. Close the game out. Are you sh This will be their final push. To at the very least, send this into Golden Point extra time. Harry Grant. Take him down. Solid. Solid clean up there from Nathan Cleary. Zero tackle in that. The hell? Alright, I guess it's zero tackle. Interesting. Outside, inside. Api Kuroisao. All right, that's the game. That's that should be the game in the bag. We almost came up with what's one of the worst blunders. Would have been an all-time choke. Full time, full time, and we barely get away from the Maroons here. Not gonna lie, we did get a little comfortable, especially throwing the ball around in our own twenty. But we do hang on to go one up in the series. Harry Grant actually picks up man of the match. That's interesting. But yeah, as always, boys, if you enjoyed that and would like to see more League Life 4 content and more content in general, be sure to run and show the like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you later.